the fringe writers are really trying to um, draw parallels between this future world that we live in and where we started, which is pretty cool. Um, like just putting these loose ends and connecting them, connecting all these little dots. And in season one, I remember this episode because it was the episode in which I thought that Astrid was dead um, and done for because Walter, um, they're looking at this big cylinder thing on this table and they can't figure it out. They don't really know what it's made of or, or what it does or what it's there for. And, uh, and Walter's afraid that if Astrid knows what's going on, that um, somebody's going to try and get the information from her and then they're going to kill her. So he ends up stabbing her in the neck with a sedative. And, um, and she's, I just remember doing that scene where she's like so completely immersed in this, in this cylinder and wondering, you know, what is this thing? And then she drops to the floor and she's all sedated. So here we are in season five. This Astrid has never had that experience because of course we've shifted to a different timeline. So she doesn't recall being sedated while she was looking at the cylinder, but I, Jessica Nicole, remember it very well. Here we are in the future, um, and it ends up being a really important part of, of this plan that they have to uh, use all these different tech pieces and devices to, um, to overthrow the observers.